Oh, that's great. All right, man. You ready for an intense Christmas quiz? Sure, man. What's uh, is it just about Christmas in general or? Yeah. And it's, I'm, I went with the medium one, so it's not the easy quiz. It's a little bit tougher. Probably too tough. Like uh, tough as a $5 steak or what? Um, not that tough. There's a harder version too. <laughs> this one's a little, this one's not the hardest version. I should have said dollar, uh, the dollar store. I think dollar store's selling steaks now. I don't know. All right, and I'm also putting a Yuletide uh, thing here so that people can see that. Sweet. <laughs> Just want to get in the mood, you know? <laughs> uh, hold on, let me set this up. Okay. Here we go. Number one. Which of these companies was the first to use Santa Claus in an advertisement? Pepsi, Coca-Cola, 7-Up, or Fanta? Oh, that was a tough one. Uh, I'm going to go Coca-Cola. They're pretty known for some, some advertising. And... You are correct. It is Coca-Cola. Nice. Nice, nice, yep. All right, number two. Which president was the first to decorate the White House Christmas tree? Franklin Pierce, Benjamin Franklin, George Washington, or Abraham Lincoln? Uh, I'm going to go with the first, uh, George Washington. George Washington. Incorrect. It is Franklin Pierce. Franklin Pierce, okay. Which, Arizona education, I have never heard of Franklin Pierce. <laughs> so It would be so ironic if he was from Arizona. <laughs> Your own Arizonian. Yeah, we don't even know are our there, own people. Are there many famous Arizonians? Um, yeah, there are, guys are kind there, of... there are, and I always remember, I'm like, oh, they're from Arizona, cool, and then I forget who they are. So I, I never... <laughs> I never do that, but there are some. We got a couple. All right, number three. Which country did the gingerbread house come from? Austria, Switzerland, Germany, or the United States? This is tough. This is tough. I won't, uh, it's down to Germany or Switzerland. Um, Germans are really good. for. They're known for their uh, engineering. <laughs> but Switzerland, what is it, like chocolate? Swiss Army Knife? I'm going to go with Switzerland. The answer, unfortunately, is Germany. <laughs> You're Dang, correct. I mean, Germany. Should have went, went with my gut. All right. Go with the gut. All right, number four. What kind of Christmas does Elvis Presley sing about? White, red, blue, or snowy? I don't know. That's a scary Christmas movie, singing about a red Christmas. Um, well, Santa's red. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say a white Christmas. <laughs> I'm gonna say a white. It's gonna. It's either white or snowy. I'm gonna go with a uh, white Christmas. You say white. Unfortunately, it's blue. What? He sings of a blue Christmas. Elvis must have been high. Let me look that up. I've oh, never heard of that. Peanut, you must have been high on peanut butter and uh, banana sandwiches. Okay, hold on. I got it. Okay, that's about enough with Elvis that I can listen to. All right, so it was Blue Christmas. I just uh, verified. That's interesting. Never heard of it. It's, a, it's not like a sad Christmas blue. Like, what's that song? I do, I do. <laughs> blue. Oh, I'm a D. I'm a D. I'm a D. I'm a D. I'm just. I didn't want to sing too much because it's gonna get stuck in your head. I don't want to be <sighs> responsible for doing that. Too late now. All right, number five. In what year was A Christmas Carol by Charles Dickens published? 1765, 1843, 1860, or 1906? I'm gonna do seven. The seventeen. The first one. You are incorrect. It's 1843. Okay, I knew 19 was way too... Way too soon. I th I th yeah, I think I reviewed a movie that was close to that <laughs> time. And I know it's been redone so many times. 
Yeah. All right, number six. What is the name of the Grinch's dog in the movie How the Grinch Stole Christmas? Pete, Sam, Ruth, or Max? Man, I didn't even study up for this one, just to FYI. <laughs> but Max. No, no, no heads up, no warning. I couldn't have, I couldn't even coordinate it with you and, and did the uh, Grinch as a review. You say, uh, you say Max, and looks like Media Glitch in the chat says Max. They are correct. It is Max. All right, thanks. I didn't see the chat though, but thanks for believing in me. <laughs> <laughs> there you go. We got somebody looking out for you. What's up, Media Glitch? Joel, I assume. All right, number seven. Where was A Christmas Carol written? Uh, Joel on Media Glitch, by the way, was doing a, a quiz earlier. Super Nintendo quiz. And I, I should call it a Super Nintendo beat-em-up quiz, because that's all it was. He didn't do any other games, because he's okay. greedy. All right, number seven. Where was A Christmas Carol written? Australia, United States, Germany, or the United Kingdom? Uh, I just want to say Germany just because I was wrong earlier with Germany. <laughs> I'm going with Germany every time. That's one of the answers. Let's go Germany. I think they did that in World War II. Uh, the answer <laughs> is... Oh, hold on. The answer is the United Kingdom. United Kingdom. You're killing me. <laughs> Alright, number eight. Which reindeer helps Rudolph fly at the reindeer games? Donner, Clarice, Dancer, or Blitzen? And you're Clarice? Right, Clarice? I don't think is Clarice... like a character from Sauce of the Lamb. Yeah, that's what I was thinking. Like, hello, Clarice. <laughs> this is a oh my god, man. I'm dying here. Uh, it was Blitzen one of them? Let's yeah. go for Blitzen. Let's... Combat, Blitzen. I think, is a cleaning product also. The answer is Clarice. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> That's it, I'm done. I'm, done. <laughs> uh, I'm getting cold for Christmas. Some of these, I don't know what they are. Is this really it? Like, Rudolph at the Reindeer? Was there Reindeer Games that I didn't know about? Isn't that a movie about, like, a horror movie or something? Anyway, number nine. Which reindeer is Rudolph's dad? Dancer, Dixon, Donner, or Blitzen? Uh, Blitzen. You say Blitzen. According to this, it's Donner. <laughs> Donner's Rudolph's dad. I had no idea Rudolph even had a dad. I thought he was kind of like a biblical character that spawned out of nothing. All right, number 10. Which Christmas movie has been played more than any other? One of your past reviews is on here. Uh, a Christmas wow. Story, Home Alone, Frosty the Snowman, or It's a Wonderful Life? And this has been played... Wow. I'm curious to see what the answer is uh, myself. Uh, I'll say a Wonderful Life. You say Wonderful Life and... You are correct, as well as the chat. Uh, Joel, you are correct as well. A Wonderful Life. Did you know the reason is because... I think it's because it, they, it wasn't successful when it first came out. And they just dropped the license. It's something like that. And then somebody just picked I it up. I just and... assumed it's it's an old, it's black and white. It's been around for a long time. And I see it on for Christmas. It's like uh, every Christmas, it's always on there. So It is. Yeah, I think it, it came out because of a licensing thing. And they just started using it all the time. And then people were like, hey, you know what? This movie isn't so bad. And then now it's a big thing. So what you're saying is no one owns the rights like uh, Romero's first uh, zombie movie? Yeah, just like that. Because that's, yeah, that's everywhere. You can go to...